most of the construction industry, architects, general contractors, and subcontractors utilize virtual design and construction to build their buildings virtually before we build them in the field. And that allows the construction industry to build them faster, um, higher quality, uh, less expensive. We are going to renovate room 118 in Guggenheim Hall. Uh, we're going to convert it to the Mortensen Center for Virtual Design and Construction. Well, in this room, I know that we're hoping to be able to provide the students with a technology that they can use every day in the classroom because this is something that we use every single day out on the job site. So what we can do with technology these days is create a building in 3D and literally walk through it. It's really going to benefit both the students and the industry. It's kind of a paying it forward, if you will. There's many aspects to what makes a, a great leader in our industry and the virtual design and construction room is going to provide them with a greater toolkit to be able to come out and hit the ground running so that this will help them gain that confidence early on. We are absolutely thrilled with the quality of students that we're getting from Kakara Estate and want to help those students even be more qualified. Here's the central utility plant. Like we're talking. So we have a very strong base of CSUCM alumni and we wanted to allow them the opportunity to be part of the process. So what we did was whatever contribution that our employee put into the fund, we doubled that uh, contribution. I donated myself and what you do is you just, you pick an amount that you want to give to the university and Mortensen will match it two to one. I just wanted to give back and just see it keep going. So with that Mortensen CCU connection, I had the opportunity to do that. All the justices. There's tons of Rams at Mortensen and we're excited to stay involved for many, many years to come. The students that graduate come out of just a great program and it's great for them to be able to give back to the program that has given so much to them. You know, the win-win is we get strong leaders that come out of the program that are now leading our company and helping us become the future generation of the industry.